Hello folks, and welcome back to Survival Challenge here on Numa Sand. And this is going to be the final episode in the series. So yeah, we've been coming a long way. We started the series back in June of last year, so about 8 months we've been on for. And yeah, over the last 65 episodes or so, we have done a lot. We started off with just a little Keith tractor on the plot of land. With what? 20 grand, 25 grand we started off with. And over the course of the last few years on the farm, we have transformed this farm to the point now where we own most of the map. Yes, I tell you right now, we can own the entire map if we wish to, but I didn't have a purpose for those, so we won't. But yeah, so we start off with selling off the manure, so. Yeah, I think a lot of this we can put into the BGA. Because, yeah, what I'm going to do is, once we're done with everything, we're going to sell everything. And then, on that. And then, yeah, so we'll see how much we sand afterwards. And, yeah, we're having issues with emptying that, so. That is empty. Off. You know what? Screw it. Let's just sell this. You know what? Yeah, just screw it. Let's just sell this at the shop. So let's go and sell this. And yeah, we should get some decent money for this. And the unloading speed should be quite fast. <laughs> yeah, just look at that money going up. Like, I can't believe how much money we've earned in this series. Like, tens of millions. And that's us restricting ourselves at to certain points, so that's a hundred grand for that. How much for the slurry? And there we go. Setting off the slurry, and this is gonna take a hot moment, so let's just jump cut till we have sold the last bit of this slurry. And there we go, last little bit of the slurry. And yeah, we still got another 100,000 litres or so, but for now, yeah, I'm not fast than that. So yeah, that is another 600 grand. And now let's go and grab the digestive if you've got anything to sell. I'm not sure if he said storing or distribution. Yeah, we had everything set to sell, so we had, yep, yeah, 11,000 litres, and that's from like the last half an hour or so. Anyway, let's go and sell this, and I think for our last product at the moment, so I want to get into that harvesting because that's going to be interesting. Is the milk? I think we've got about five, six hundred thousand years worth, something like that. So there we go. That is just over six hundred and twenty thousand years of milk sold. And one thing we need to also do. So yeah, 773 grand, and I have noticed there is a sudden demand for eggs, so not up here, just here, so yeah, compared to everything else, 4,200 pounds. I am not saying no to that. So let's go and get these eggies still sold. Yeah, like literally, it would be rolled in in money. And that's before the harvest. Like, I don't think you can just comprehend like how vast this field is. So yeah, obviously you got all of this, all of this. Ignore the grapes. I'm done with the grapes. Not doing them anymore. First of all, I thought, yeah, try to do a heads in the net. But then I've got an idea. It's gonna be a controversial idea. Probably tell by the thumbnail of how exactly we're going to be doing this harvest. But this way, we're going to be harvesting, bathing, and loading those bells all at once. But first of all, we need to get these walls picked up because we're full once again. Go boom, boom, boom. There we go. Not really, ah, one pallet. 
I can lift it. Uh, oh, yeah, we'll get these moved and not screw it. Let's go and sell these and then we'll head to the dealership and look at what I've gone and purchased. So, there we go. Selling the wool. I think I didn't realise we had that much, so. Actually, one thing we can do is start selling some of this, so let's go to our traders. Carry that. Not too grand for that. And how much are we going to get for the wool? 53 grand. And that's like literally overnight, that was, I think. But, anyways, we've had the combine here warmed up, so. Yep, it's still the Colossus. It's the Colossus 9000. And as we move to the back, we've got the Kate Super Wide Rotor Cutter, this little bader. And then hopefully the bell should come out of here. And then we'll go straight on to the Farm Tech Auto Load. And yep, yeah, I'm hoping this all works because. This was a lava to get hooked up, so I'm using the stuffle strip to so yeah, so to the combine. That would be where you tow your headers. And then obviously you've got a three point leakage option, but don't need that, just need the ball, ball hitch option. But yeah, the controversial one, that's not controversial at all. Or at least compared to let's get to the field and run about just everything we've got. He's already away. Problem solved. Yeah, since yeah, I'm not, not having to use it anymore. Might as well set it. So, first of all, I want to make sure everything is set up. So, little beater. Unfold beater. I just want to make sure the header is unfolded. Go. So let's turn on operating. Uh, nope, don't feel me that. Operating position, I think, yeah, that's all good. But yes, yeah, go and load the header. Actually, perhaps we should worry about a side tip on this. Ah, no, screw it, it's fine. Let's go turn on the combine. And there we go, we are harvesting. And yes, I am using the 50, I think it's the 50 meter header I'm using. Yeah, 50 meters it is, so. Yep, yeah, it is controversial. Like here, not. But still, you need to get all of this done, like, seriously, like, the bathing, the harvesting, yeah, get it all done at once, and, ooh, look, what have I forgot to select? Oh, for you, the belt is at its maximum capacity. So, yeah, at the moment, we are 3% full, almost, on the combine. So that is, what, a million year capacity or something like that, 1.2 million. We're halfway through our first bell. So yeah, we're going to be getting 90,000 year short bells. So yeah, that is going to be fun. One thing to note is, one, you need to be careful not missing the edges. And two, with the bathing that can just go swing left and right now because it will cause issues. Okay, we've got our first bell coming out. There we go. If I say Ah bugger, bell type is not supported. This is why you test things, so since we're using the selectable bell capacity mod, 
So yeah, we need to select one of these. Oh no, it's the ultimate beating pack we're using. My apologies. So yeah, looks like we're going to need to use one of these. Actually, can we do a tandem? That's a ball hitch. Oh dang it, that's a pin hitch. See, that's what I was thinking. Wait a minute, is that? Oh uh, yeah, looks like we need to... You know what? Fine. I'll just go say, screw you. And let's continue on to harvesting. So, yeah, we see what we're doing. So, yeah, I think we we'll just know what we'll just do the bait separately. And actually, one thing. And it didn't work. Yeah, I thought, yeah, get some slice additive in here. Nope. I know with some baiters, it, it does work with the size additive using A or straw net. Well it's more so straw definitely. It's the one that shouldn't work, but I thought you never know that yeah generally you don't know so Yeah like we are harvesting and baiting at the same time. Do we get a bell counter or anything like that? Nope. Oh yeah, because look on here, so, so far we've produced two bells. Yeah, I think we've produced more than that, but perhaps it counts it when it's unloaded. Ah, yes, it's when it's unloaded, so... And yeah, these are huge, well, not one, he one thousand years, not my six thousand year bells, but still... Missed a bit. Yeah, I was like, see how much straw we get from this. Yeah, the amount of straw is absolutely crazy, and I've got to turn Discord off. But yeah, see the gist of where we're going with this. And yeah, so we are at 7% of fills. And I think even with this, we still need to undo this because. Yeah, we got all this to do, so let's go and get this harvesting done, and I'll see you folks afterwards once we are done here.
right, there we go. We are done with Final Harvest. So, overall, that was 2.1 million litres of wheat. So, is that wheat or barley? Barley. Yeah, not wheat, barley. And with, with hats, we got a lot of straw from that. So, we've gone and done bathing and with, yeah with bells I did a mixture of square bells and round bells because yeah square bather was working fine in that but even with the wide width of it we were still missing so many bits but the majority of our bells were square bells but yeah let's go and sell this barley actually you know what everything set to sell and I did include at the end of the time lapse of a us skipping forward a bit because now everything's on sale so also yeah I ended up removing that pet production that was because of uh, what was it using it on a well, using a different map in that and where's Greenville to? Ah Greenville's over there I was guessing where the hell was Greenville but yeah obviously with doing map tours and that recently I ended up in the pellet production, but to be honest, we was done with it anyway, so I'm not going to be using that mod again for, at least for the foreseeable future, like, we've going to, with, with us being at Ravenport, we've got ideas for firewood, there we go, just make sure I should put a barley in, but yeah, we've got firewood that planned for Ravenport, with Evergreen Valley, ooh, no, we're going to do pellets there, because yeah, Evergreen, that's going to be an uh, awesome space series, like, overnight and that, I've been thinking, and been cooking some ideas up, in a way, it's going to be sort of, it's not, not going to be survival challenge as such, because we will have some things in our favour, but, yeah, we're going to start off with very small nets. We'll leave our money behind here at No Man's Land. And we'll hop across the pond to America and head to Every Valley. So, I'm at 2.1 million years. We're still left with 1.75 mil. Uh, where is it the best place to sell the barley? Even if it doesn't make too much of a difference. So everything container it is. And then yeah, with the bells. So yeah, in total with the bell situation. We go and have a look. So yeah, 117 bells. And actually the, the size of our fields, which were stopped, is almost 300 acres, 276, 78 acres. Until we've done Six over <laughs> six thousand acres of work land, and yep, half that is to spraying. Apparently, we've done ninety-eight thousand meters of grapes until we've worked ninety-two hours. Yeah, three hundred and twenty-six hours on this Let's Play series. Yeah, in terms of fuel and that, 45,000 litres, 3,000 litres, or 3,000 miles driven. And yeah, that's the thing, yeah, I have absolutely loved this map, and I think it's a classic. I think it was on FS17, I think it was. <coughs> Obviously, I've only played since FS19, but apparently this was on FS17. Oh, no, I'm thinking of other... Jim did other maps for FS17, but I can't remember exactly. But, anyways, let's go and sell this. And can we hit 50 mil? By the time everything's sold, we sold our animals. Yeah, sure. So, yeah, what we're going to do is sell our animals next once we've run out of food. And then we'll skip ahead. Wait until all of our productions are run through. And then, yeah, that's going to be it for the series. Well, yeah, so let's go and see how much we got. 1.9 million pounds. Or dollars, because I was on Ravenport recently. 
But yeah, now, let's head over to the bells and also got our equipment to sell, so. Yeah, overall, we've got. In terms of ram bells, we've got 1.15 million litres of ram bells. Because, yeah, these are 50,000 year bells. With square bells, we've got 35 here. Along with another 42, times that by 81,000 litres, that is. Da, 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 6.237 million litres. So, in total, we're at just shy of 7.4 million litres. So, and yeah, 7.4 million litres of straw. And once again, we're going to see where we can sell it for the best price. Uh, yeah, so, <coughs> so, pet production, can't do that, manure factory, new. No. However, we can turn this straw to manure, but it's going to take forever to process, so, farm shop it is. I should want to skip to December a sec. So, yeah, there we go, December, 9 o'clock, 42.2 mil we're at now. And, yeah, best place to sell now is on sell every container by Schultz, and, yeah, 87 pounds for a thousand years, and we've got almost 7.4 million years, so, this is going to be fun, especially with this trader sub, so, my feet can is go, look right, swing around, and there we go. So yeah, I doubt we're gonna get everything sold at once, but we'll give it a go. So we'll set to you. Strap you down. Strap those down. So yeah, have all of our seven million years of bells we've got, or seven million years of straw. We've got three mil here. So let's go and. Undo the tension straps. See how much money we can get. Because, yeah, I am curious, like... How much money we can get from this, and... Yeah, it's going to take a while, so I'll jump cut to when we're completing this. So, for all that straw, that was about 200 and... Yeah, 275 grand. And what I've got done is... Save the hassle with selling. I bought the uh, mobile cell point, and yeah, this is the bell cell point. So, all we need to do now is simply drive up to these bells, and then poof, they'll be gone. So, yeah, we got 275 grand last time. So, if I had to guess, I'll say it'd be another 350 grand. So yeah, I guess in front of fifty grand. But again, I could be wrong. There we go, they're all going now. Come on, another three hundred and fifty grand. Can we get to forty three mil? Come on. Forty three mil baby, come on. Ah crap. Sixty nine thousand. Nice, but yeah, that was four hundred and 47 grand, so all in all, for bells, that is 723,000 pounds. So, yeah, let's go and sell soy though. So, yeah, we've got a bit of sugar beet cut, TMR, and that. You know what? We're selling the animals, so let's go and sell everything. Productions run through, first of all, so. Including chickens, they still got a bit of food left, so I'm gonna let them run. Let them cook. Yeah, I've still got a bit here, so yeah, you know what? Leave it with me. I'm gonna let all this run through, and then by the time all the productions are run through, or by the time all the animals are out of food, I think that'd be a good point to set up, and then yeah, we'll head out of the gate and end this series. And there we go, for the final time, we are here, and yep, yeah, we sell the sheep now. 
So yeah, we skipped ahead quite a bit. Yeah, because we're in October now to following year. Yeah, probably I will set things for now. Also, I have to wait another month because the chickens and the sheep, they ran out of feeds. And like the cows, when I saw the cows and I was like, why are we only getting like 600 pounds for them? That's because they were not healthy because they hadn't been fed. So I did do a bit of a cheeky purchase of some hay. But yeah, so gone and sold some stuff. So we sold our silos. Haven't sold any of our production, so I'm just going to leave them here. Actually, sure what? Screw it. Let's go and sell everything. If we get decent money for it. There we go. Have things going on in here, but. Yeah, so we're at over 50 mil. Actually, no, need some diesel before we go. And actually, you know what? We need to sell this equipment as well because I won't be taking much with us onto our new series. Yeah, because I've got plans for America, at least two plans for the States. And yeah, I'm going to be taking none of these. So yeah, 50 and a half mil. But yeah, I'll be taking the John Deere with us. Actually, you know what? Yeah, no screw it, excuse the mobile cell point. But yeah, I didn't realise we had, I knew we had the honey, but I didn't realise we still had eggs and milk around, so... You know what? I ain't complaining. Uh, you know what? See, so yeah, that's discharging. There we go, so he's unstruck that. Go and grab you. Ah, uh, yeah. Warm and turn the milk. Wait a minute. Is it discharged? Yeah, that's discharging and... Oh no, screw it. Just take it all back. Yeah, it's John Deere. We're going to be taking with us onto our new series. Why not be Evergreen Valley? Or something else? Again, as mentioned before, depends on how Vinci Survival goes. But regardless, it's going to take a few weeks yet to... Well, this is almost prepped for ship shipping. It does needs a little bit of a service, but apart from that... For the most part, it's actually all good in that. So you've got a little bit of milk to sell, and last little bits of honey. And then after that, we'll be on our way. So let's go to the farm shop. There we go. Okay, that's not selling. What about the sell everything container? Okay, I don't know why that's not selling either. And there we go, just got 12 grand for one bit of product. An additional 30 grand, that's for the honey and that. And now, just for the milk, but yeah. We're gonna be hitting 51 mils, no problem whatsoever, so. And initially we can sell everything. Just not that pallet just yet. So yeah, that is us at 50.97 mil. And there we go, so that is another 280 grand for the milk. And I thought, before we go, let's give this a service. So this has been serviced. This has been repainted. I finally, after 66 episodes, got beacons on this. And even I fit some dual BKT tires on it, so... Now we are all prepared, so, <coughs> yeah. yeah, it's been a while since I've ended the Let's Play series, but, yeah, again, this has been such a good map to us, and now, uh, actually, what, let's drive around one more time as we're leaving, but yeah, like, seriously, like, we started with one bit of plot of land, yeah, I'll admit, after, what, ten episodes, things get a bit crazy very quickly, Plus we was making so much money. But here's the thing. The economy difficulty has been on normal. We haven't been having this on easy mode. 
But yeah, that's just because of all these production chains. Like, when we was planning this industrial area, this industrial complex, we started with the BGA. I knew the BGA was the key to absolute millions, and yeah, it's proved itself. Things like industrial bakery, the modern Brazilian industrial, whatever, flour mill, and sugar mill. And yeah, with all the fills as well, we've done such other rotations. Yeah, we've used some unrealistic equipment, that's sort of been the series. But yeah, I think we've done every crop type. With the exception of olives and poplar, and yeah, all seed radish as well, and yeah, premium crops, but yeah, that's not really for this series. So that, yeah, the whole premium expansion came out very late into the series, and I only nailed it for a couple of the mods and that. But yeah, so yeah, plans are now. This will be out uh, 3 o'clock. This is 3 o'clock Sunday, so not screw it, let's have an evening upload. Get us up this evening. Court Farm will be out tomorrow on Monday, along with a episode on the Lonka with Vintage Survival. And yeah, also the new Let's Play series on Every Valley. That may be out Monday or Tuesday in that. But yeah, I think overall we have done good. We are at 51 million pounds now and yeah 330 hours almost on this series we've cut down well over 2,000 trees planted a couple of trees and yeah in terms of seed and yeah, furrows usage no idea actually you know what oh collectibles just to say we've completed the map so let's go up here and yeah the collectibles on this map are all on top of the shed, I did a video on this, but I'm gonna get 50 grand for each of these, and these are 20 of these, and the last collectible. On, well, now it's the last collectible. We have found all of the cartridges, so yeah, I thought, yep, we've be beaten No Man's Land. We have survived. Definitely, like, yeah, all we started off with was the little international tractor and a plot of land and 25 grand. And from that, we've turned into this. 66 episodes in, and yeah, I was hoping for 100 episodes in. Maybe the next Let's Play series on Everything Valley, that may be a 100 episode series. Until when FS25 comes out later on this year. Uh, hopefully, I, I don't know, I, I know nothing about from Sin 25 or 26, whatever it's going to be called or when it's going to be, but based on the cycle now of FS22 of three years from 19, it makes sense we have FS25 out this year, but if we do have it, it's going to be announced at FarmCon. That's typically when Giants will announce it. But yeah, for the last time, here on No Man's Land, I hope you enjoyed the episode, I hope you enjoyed the series. If so, smash that button. Feel free to comment down below. If you want sharing some please be on my guests. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, then please consider. But whatever you choose to do, hope you're gonna stay. But for now, this is me Farmer Envoy Extreme, and I'll see you all very soon.